To start the Caldera RIP installation, double-click the DMG file, then launch the Caldera installer. Click Continue. As the Caldera installer wants to make changes to the current system, we must type the administrator password. A pop-up should appear at this step, informing you that XQuartz has been installed. XQuartz is a utility that allows to run Caldera RIP on macOS. Installing XQuartz is a mandatory step, therefore, it is done automatically when performing Caldera RIP first install on macOS. To complete the installation process, we must restart the computer. After restarting, we can double-click the DMG file again, then launch the Caldera installer. Click Continue. Once again, we must type the administrator password. The installation is now initializing. Welcome to the Caldera RIP installation wizard. First, we select the language for this installation. This language will also be the default language when running the software. Then we click the right arrow to go to the next step. When using the full DMG file, two choices are available at this step. A simple installation will automatically install and configure additional services such as VNC server and other helpful applications. It will also share some folders to ease the network configuration and communication with the printers. Alternatively, the advanced option offers the choice to disable specific services. Be aware that if some options or services are not selected, Caldera RIP might not function properly. Therefore, in a production environment, we highly recommend you to choose Simple Installation. Then we go to the next step. As the full installer is used here, we can already choose the printers we want to install. If the printers are already visible in the local network, the Auto Detect button would allow us to automatically install the corresponding drivers. To install a printer manually, we simply browse for the manufacturer and the model, then we click Add. Next, we can repeat the process for cutters installation. Note that the Auto Detect option is no longer available at this step. Here is a summary of the current installation. Let's click the thumb up to start the installation. We click Yes, then Continue. The installation takes approximately 10 minutes to complete. Great, Caldera RIP installation is finished. Click OK. Before restarting the system, you will also need to grant full disk access to Caldera RIP.